Hi, this is Jeff Burke from Broadband Forum, and we're here in Warsaw, Poland at the Q1 meeting. And um, I've been pulling together different work area directors to chat through what activities they're involved with here, both uh, uh, currently at the Q1 meeting and going forward. And uh, I have here Marta Seda, who is the um, the work area director for the fiber access network segment. Hi, Marta, how are you? Oh, I'm doing fine. Great, well, thank you for joining us here today. Um, I wanted to just uh, let um, you, in your own words, talk a little bit about what uh, uh, fiber access networks or FAN work area is. So uh, the, um, the FAN fiber access networks uh, area is responsible for uh, several project streams. Uh, one is related to the pond management project stream that handles the, uh, it, which is WT385, which handles the pond yang uh, aspect, uh, which supports uh, groups like the SDN NFV uh, work area. Uh, we also are uh, working on uh, tests and interrupt a, pro a project stream which uh, handles uh, the PON PMD test plan as well as the ID247 issue 4 OMCI test plan, uh, which are, are all part of certification and compliance testing purposes. Uh, and then uh, uh, this, this uh, quarter, uh, we had uh, also activity in the um, wavelength, uh, wavelength management, management project stream, WT385, which handles the ICTP protocol. Okay, well, you know, as I understand it, you play a bit of a unique role here at the forum and that uh, the work activity streams are critical in supporting other work areas, really, and feeding them and getting their, their, uh, their work going forward. Is that, uh, is that an accurate statement? Yes, that's an accurate statement. Uh, for example, uh, as I mentioned before, WT385 uh, uh, is actually helping both, uh, the, it feeds into the SDN and NFV um, work area work on uh, management. Uh, as well as uh, we recently completed uh, study 417, which is on NetCOF um, uh, test requirements, mm -hmm. uh, that is actually being used as a base to WT435, which the SDN NFV group is working uh, towards writing uh, access node uh, uh, test cases, um, well, actually requirements that mm -hmm. eventually will generate test uh, cases. All right, understood. Well, I know that, uh, you know, here we are coming off of just a week or two after the OFC show in San Diego, a lot of activity in uh, in around the fiber component uh, area. Um, and here we are now in, in, uh, in Warsaw. So what are some of the things that have been leading up to and are actually we're working on right now here at this meeting in, in some of your uh, your active areas? So uh, from, the, from the OFC perspective, uh, uh, fiber um, ma manufacturers uh, should be interested in WT423, the POM PMD test plan uh, that is a, a compliance test plan. Uh, we, are, we completed issue one back in, uh, I believe it was January mm -hmm. uh, 2019. We are now working uh, towards issue two. Uh, to issue, to address some gaps in WT423. Uh, okay. Um, now, as we look forward here over the coming couple of months and maybe even throughout the rest of the year, I understand you have a lot of uh, activity on uh, on your plate in those areas too. What uh, What's coming down the pike here for the fan work area? Right. So in 2019, what we're going to be working towards is uh, WT385, uh, the Pan Yang uh, project. There are many items that we need to address uh, that were not addressed in issue one. Uh, so there, I expect a lot of activity in that area. Uh, in in the, the next quarter, we were actually expecting to send to straw ballot the POM PMD issue two uh, test plan, as well as the um, WT352 ICDP, ICDP um, uh, requirements document uh, to straw ballot. Okay, great. A lot of uh, exciting activity heading out through the rest of the year. So I wanted to congratulate you on your great uh, work uh, in the fan work area up to date. And okay. um, and looks like you have a really full plate for the rest of the year. So, okay. all right. With that, uh, this, is, uh, uh, this is Jeff Burke signing off from uh, Warsaw, Poland.